Alright, I'm ready for the final boss now. Let's get going. And this looks incredible. I actually did patch myself off up oh. off camera and uh So now I'm saving before this fight. Because this is one of the strongest bosses in the game, because after all, it's the final boss. Can you see it? The other side of time. Actually, I only see a lightning yeah. storm. But he's not going to be alone. As you'll see. See, we have basically three extra enemies to fight. And, uh, this guy. Uh, say hello to Susan Owl, the one of the primordial gods and the strong, the final boss in Shadow Hearts Covenant. I recommend, actually, of the underlings, take out the, the jewel, because all your status ups are going to be cancelled out. So this is what I'm going to do. Let's see this turn is up next. It's Aurora Oil and Moon Oil. <laughs> right. Now, take out the Yes, a Kani Gem, I think that's what it's called. But since all my attacks do third key, I'm gonna plow through this boss like nothing. But it's still gonna have turn. Okay. The gem's still there. So as long as it's still there, I'm still not safe. Got him. And what that does is increases uh, yeah, special attack. It's basically like Arc Surge. So let's get rid of the sword. Just in case you're wondering, these are all the royal treasures the Japanese regalia. Because Kusanagi is the legendary sword. Okay, that does fire damage, and that normally paralyzes, but it does Ow. Let's get rid of the mirror. Okay, that worked. Now that just leaves the sword. Got him. Now for the boss, he actually has a lot of health, so I'm gonna actually utilize some seventh keys. Now I know this is the cheapest way to beat this boss, but this is what I've always done. After all, you don't get any uh, anything special from uh, keeping all your keys and not using them. So I'm going to actually use them now because I won't be using them again in this playthrough. Gotcha.
That did quite a bit of damage. It took off quite a bit of health, too. And in case you're wondering, I don't know what the final boss music is for this. did 3,000 damage. He's going to do that again, which he doesn't learn that that does nothing because Anastasia has absolutely... is completely resistant to paralysis. I don't know why he kept on targeting her, though. Not as strong. Let's try the fifth key. I'm saving the seventh key for Yuri. But I think with her ring, I'm gonna miss easily. Or, never mind. Now, the final boss has been defeated. So that means the game will be finished. And there's going to be an, another cutscene. This isn't the... this is the ending regardless. Uh, it's not the good ending, it's not the bad ending, it just finishes things up. I thought you wanted the world destroyed. Soon, Takamagahara and the vessel will disappear within the time warp. Once you've set foot here, you can't return to the present. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, looks that way. You must pray. Pray. As hard as you can for the world, the world you want. The world I want? Yes. Uh, the best one you can imagine. Uh, hey! Then you can return. Kato! Um, he's dying, Yuri, so... My friend. Sorry. And then he's gonna... Yeah, he's gonna disappear into that. Like every... last Japanese boss. Last Japanese game boss. Now I'm gonna be quiet for the good ending because it's actually there's really not much to say about it. We can do it if we really try. Yes. I'm gonna wrap up here. I will see you later.